Zlatan Ibrahimovic got the ball rolling for Paris Saint-Germain as the champions kicked off the defence of their Ligue 1 crown on Friday night. Bon Blanc's side certainly didn't have it all their own way though as they were made to pay for some wasteful finishing. Ibrahimovic's opener was cancelled out by Prince Onyange. He got on the end of a Diego free kick. It's a level at one apiece on 22 minutes. And that was before Gaetan Charbonnier and Antoine Deveau linked up superbly for the latter to put Rance ahead on 34 minutes. The hosts couldn't hold on though. Ibrahimovic popping up with a 62nd minute equaliser. Courtesy of some poor goalkeeping from Johnny Placide to salvage a point for PSG. That's now four straight season openers without a win for the Capital Club. Radamel Falcao made a goal scoring return for Monaco but couldn't help Leonardo Jardim's men from sliding to defeat. L'Oreal striker Vincent Abubakar stuck away an early penalty for Sylvain Ripple's men before Falcao came off the bench to level from the spot for his first league goal since November. 20-year-old Valentin Lavigne had the final say though, scoring a late winner on his Lorient debut in a 2-1 victory at the Stade Louis II. Christopher Mabulu had a debut to remember. Bastia's summer signing put the islands ahead against Marseille and new boss Marcelo Bielsa after just nine minutes in Corsica. Andre Pierre Gignac popped up with an immediate reply for Marseille, powering at a header. And that was before Ivory Coast midfielder Romeric put through his own net in a rather comical style to give Marseille the lead. Gignac then notched his second of the match in the penalty spot after a handball from Sebastian Scalacci. But Cloud Makalele's Bastia showed plenty of spirit, firstly to grab a lifeline after Gadju Talo pulled one back after Mabulu was appended. Bastia then secured a share of the spoils in a thrilling 3 all draw as Mabulu netted his second 17 minutes from time. Injury hit Leon began the campaign in promising fashion as they handed new boss Hubert Fournier his first win at the Stade Gerland against Rennes. Tidmo Bronx slotted home a well-taken goal to break the deadlock just past the hour mark before Alexandre Lacazette opened his account for the season with an unstoppable penalty. Ten minutes later, 2-0 Leon is how it finished. Saint-Étienne were without their two new major signings, but they could still count on Mevlut Erding to deliver the goods away to Gangon. Erding continued his rich vein of form, carrying on from last season by slotting home a first-half penalty at the Stade de Rouderoux, before pouncing on a misplaced back pass to round Gangon goalkeeper Mamadou Samassa and complete his brace in a 2-0 victory. Cole marked their return to the top flight in style with a resounding victory away to Evian. Nagoto Kante started things off for the visitors with a 12 minute opener in Annecy. That's before Mathieu Duhamel, last season's joint leading scorer in the second tier, struck twice. Duhamel first pounced on the rebounds before adding a second with a header after he was left unmarked in a box. Two goals in the space of five minutes for Duhamel, seeing Can run out 3 0 winners. New Bordeaux coach Willie Samuels promised goals during his tenure. He got an early one from Cheikh Diabato and that was all that was needed in a 1-0 win at Montpellier. Nice struggled mightily to find the net last season. That wasn't the case against Toulouse on Saturday though. Dario Zbitanic ends a lengthy goal drought in stunning fashion to put Nice ahead at the Allianz Riviera. Two minutes of madness cost Nice dearly though at the end of the first half. First Martin Braithwaite headed Toulouse level before Wissam Ben Yedda turned the game on its head just before the interval to hand the visitors a 2-1 lead. Svetanic though restored parity just past the hour, turning in his second from close range before Alexi Bassetti celebrated his two-year contract extension with the game's winning goal on 68 minutes as Nice recorded a 3-2 victory. It was a cagey affair at the Stade Pierre Mohoua where Lille hosted Metz, last season's Ligue 2 champions. Johan Carrasco, the younger brother of Bordeaux keeper Cedric, was to thank as Metz earned a valuable point against René Girard's side. Champions League hopefuls Lille struggled without last season's top scorer Salomon Kalou, whose future may well lie elsewhere. 
It's been a frustrating summer for both Nantes and newly promoted Lantz, but debutante Yassine Bamu ensured Nantes got off to a winning start to let Bourgeois scoring the game's only goal 32 seconds after coming on as a second half substitute in a 1 0 victory. Twenty-seven goals in total on the opening weekend. Odds on title favourites PSG dropping points on the opening weekend after being held at Rance, but Monaco missing a chance to steal a march on the champions after sliding to defeat at home to Lorient. Caught on the surprise front runners after the opening weekend. A terrific start for Patrice Garand and Co. Bitter rivals Leon and Saint Etienne round out the top three with four other sides also level on three points. PSG are 11th after drawing their opening fixture while title hopefuls Monaco one of seven sides still waiting for their first points this campaign. Evian rock bottom after a heavy defeat in Annecy. Can't host Lille on Friday night to get the ball rolling in week two while PSG are at home to Bastia on Saturday. Marseille will lock horns with Montpellier while Monaco will look to bounce back from the early setback in Sunday's late kickoff away to Bordeaux.